Wednesday normally has been synonymous with Trinidad and Tobago in more ways than one. If you talk about tourism, you will talk about the Normandy. If you talk about carnival, you will talk about the Normandy. As a matter of fact, the Hotel Normandy has been immortalized in Calypso by the late great Lord Kitchener in that immortal song, Miss Tourist. And of course, over the years, Normandy under the trees. As a matter of fact, under the season under the trees. Is, 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 is an occasion that is looked forward to in, in a lot of ways for carnival. A man named Mr. Fred Chinley, who looked beyond the politics that I practice or looked beyond anything else and only saw me for my talent. And not only did he hire me to perform under the trees, but give me the free reign of producing the shows that I want to perform under the trees. And for that, Mr. Chinley, no time is ever too much for me to spend with you as busy as I am. So I must find the time to come here. But all that aside, Normandy under the trees have become a place where people and families and friends can gather in peace for clean and cultural activities around carnival time. The entertainment that you would find and the packages that you would find under the trees at the Normandy are carefully put together. If you ever sit down and talk to Mr. Chinley and hear what he has for just one calypso, when he dissects that song for you and tell you what he wants to get out of that song and produce a whole show around it or have a lot of songs that you would come up with all these things. I mean, it could only be done here. And the ambience that you would find under the trees, I could stand here proudly and endorse the entertainment that, that have been put on under the trees at the Normandy and encourage everybody to come here. It has become an integral part of our carnival landscape. And I encourage Mr. Chinley to continue doing whatever you do. And you are one of the, the, the few people in this country who go ahead and do things without coming to the government and asking them for, for some kind of subvention. So Mr. Chinley, as an entrepreneur and a person who have, in a lot of ways over the years, and continue to promote Trinidad and Tobago selflessly and without much help from the government, if any at all, we applaud you for that. And we hope that the other people who are coming on would learn that this is the way you promote your country you have to take out some words from Kennedy saying, ask not what you can, what your country can do for you, but in fact, what you can do for your country. And in this case, it's ask not what your culture can do for you, but what you can do for your culture. And you have been doing quite a lot. And Normandy, I would like to take the opportunity to wish you all, all the best. And indeed, don't be surprised if you see me appear on one of the shows any night and I will do it free of charge anytime. So I just want to thank you all again for coming. Thank you for coming to the Normandy. A beautiful place to be. May God bless you. Let us have a all all have a safe and enjoyable carnival in Trinidad and Tobago.